Uh, if I was Will Smith, I would have smacked him with a stick. So Chris Rock is bitching again about getting smacked by Will Smith in the face. To be honest, I think that Chris Rock is a bitch. And this is why. Nobody's picking on this bitch. She started this shit. A lot of people go, Chris, how come you didn't do nothing back? I got parents. And you know what my parents taught me? Don't fight in front of white people. I would understand, like, I would be 100% behind Chris Rock if he said it there on point. Somebody comes, smacks you in the face, then you're like, on point, you're like, fuck this bitch, da 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 shooting out, I, then there, I get it. There, there's like, it's hats off. Nobody's picking on this bitch. She started this <laughs> But you wait a whole year, and you're sitting and you're writing it up, and now you're, now you got this aggression. Now you, all of a sudden, Fuck this bitch! Why didn't you do it in front of like you should have done it there? They're on point. Will Smith, you can say what you want about him, but he did it there on point. Yeah, he cried after and did all of that. I'm not, I'm not standing behind that. But what I stand behind is if you actually have some smoke for somebody, there, the guy's there. He's standing there right now. Why didn't you say anything? It's a blueprint and I followed it my whole career. It's very simple, there's three things you do. just do these three things. Pay your taxes, <laughs> mind your business, and keep Will Smith's wife's name Will Smith knew like, Will Smith knew like, none of y'all niggas ain't, none of y'all niggas doing jack shit. I'm gonna go smack him in the face. What the fuck are you guys gonna do? What are you guys gonna do? Jim Carrey, yeah, I, I, I would have sued him for, for a hundred million dollars. They asked Chris, do you want to file charges? And Chris apparently said, no, he did not. Yeah, because want the hassle. I, I'd have, I'd have uh, for, announced this morning that I was suing Will for $200 million because that video is going to be there forever. It's going to be ubiquitous. Nigga, what? You were there, my G. You were there. Why don't you, why don't you also go up? Why don't Jim Carrey also go up and show how, how much of a tough guy you are? I would have sued. I would have sued. Your wife is a bitch. Bro, he, he yelled at the nigga and said, nigga. He stood there and says, nigga, what? Mm-hmm. He says, keep my wife's name off the King Mouth. What are, you, what, what are you gonna do? And these niggas are still gonna give me the Oscar. Then what? I'm sitting there, I'm like... Yeah, no one is ever gonna test Will. Yeah, you, you, you can speak behind the camera. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. yeah, you can do that shit, but no one ever is gonna test Will like that. In the same room, niggas will be like, oh, you better watch that nigga Will. He might do some. He might slap you, my G. He might do something to your jaw. I would have. I would have. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, yeah, you would have, yeah, okay, that's, yeah, that's great. Why don't we listen to the guy which talks out of his ass, yeah, yeah, let's, let's try to get the guy which talks out of his ass for advice, let's try to listen to him, yeah, he knows exactly what he's doing, Jesus. Uh oh, Richard! <laughs> oh, wow, wow! When some say he crossed the line as the Oscars presenter, joking about Will Smith's wife, Jada's shaved head. Jada, I love you. G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. <laughs> Bro, that joke is funny. <laughs> G.I. Jane 2, can't wait to see it. <laughs> shit, I'm not gonna lie, that shit was low-key, low-key, low-key funny. And I'm team Will, guys. But still, that shit was low-key funny. It was, it was, what am I, what am I supposed to say? Fox joke about Jada's hair caused Smith to lose it, as heard on some of the international feeds for the Oscars. Nick Mike's name out your mouth. Wow, dude. Yeah. It was a G.I. Jane joke. Rock has said he didn't know about Jada's condition at the time. Oh, uh, 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 okay. That's what he said. Okay. What? And then let later after, then you come, she's a bitch. Where was all that smoke? Where was all that gas? 
that's why I'm saying the internet gasses most of these people up. Don't, don't pay attention to these people. The internet will gas you up and then you start thinking highly of yourself. Yeah, I, I got this, rah, rah, rah. Yeah, but in real life, when so somebody will fucking test you. So why did Will Smith hit Chris Rock? It's not because he's tough or an alpha that wanted to defend his woman. It's because he's your classic nice guy. A real man would remain stoic and reassure his woman that what he said was a joke. But Jada, like many women, lives for manipulation and found herself a nice guy who allows her emotions to drive his every action. Will no longer has a mind of his own. Every single girl needs protection and provision. You're not a real man, you're not bruh. His life is completely attached to the emotional needs of Jada instead of the actual needs of a healthy relationship. He's happy when she's happy. He's sad when she's sad. So what happens when she loses her cool at the Oscars? He loses his cool at the Oscars. In that moment, Will needed to be an example of stability for his woman. Instead, he became a vessel for her emotional outrage. And that is the least attractive thing a man can be. A woman who can't look to her man for guidance will never have respect for him. So it's no wonder she cheated on him and continues to bully him. You, you listen to people like this and they're just talking out of their ass. Oh, you're supposed to do this and you're supposed to be this person. Really? That's the person you're supposed to be? And that's, you have never done anything wrong or you have never been emotional. Or you have never sat there and just like, fuck it. I want to fuck this guy up. Of course, we've all been there. And that's, that's the problem which I have with this thing where everyone is, everyone is always knows best oh i know i if i was will smith i would have done this in this situation oh if i was will smith i would have done that you when when it comes to emotion it comes to emotion if it was suge knight or it was anybody else people wouldn't have said jack shit. like you, you see that that that's the thing which i've noticed because they know like okay will smith he apologized and he was actually emotional and they they don't perceive will smith as like a a violent dude that's why everyone is talking all this shit and I'm saying like a lot of women will be like no you're you're supposed to trust me if you're with your girlfriend some guys talk smack doesn't matter if it's Chris Rock or whoever some guy talks smack you're not gonna go up and you're gonna slap that guy you're gonna go emotional that's what I'm saying like don't just look from the perspective of he was wrong he's supposed to do this he's supposed to act stoic sometimes you know Shit goes left. It's all talk, blah, 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 blah. But when it comes to it, then you really, really see. It's like what ASAP Rocky said. Everybody plays a tough guy to ship up off. Why didn't you say anything, my guy? I'm hearing all this talk, blah, 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 blah. Da, 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 da. Comedian, da, da, da. I'm a comedian. So what, you, you're just supposed to run your mouth and no consequences are supposed to come? Come on. I think, I think the problem which we have in today's society is we got what? Everyone is copying everybody. No one has a, an opinion, actually. <clears throat> and this is the problem with society today. Everyone's just copying everybody. Oh, Will Smith's a bitch. Oh, yeah, let's run with the narrative. Come on. Are we actually going to run with that narrative just because you heard somebody say, Oh, he's a bitch right now. What? I've got smacked in the f***ing Oscars by this f***ing. And people like, did it hurt? It still hurts! Chris Rock played the long game and he got the last word and those words were hilarious. Well, it is what it is. Like, comment and share if you want to see more videos like this. What do you guys think? Is Will Smith a bitch or is Chris Rock a bitch for doing all this extra shit? Leave it in the comment and tell me what you guys think and I'll see you in the next video. Peace!